Wastewater Dan presents Wastewater Math, calculated with Excel spreadsheets. As a new service of ESDLT's Environmental Academy, environmentalacademy.com, today's example, calculate milliliters per minute of alum. Today's problem reads, Jar testing determined the best liquid alum dose is 6.1 mg slash L. The aluminum sulfate has a specific gravity of 1.26 and the solution has a strength of 52.2%. The wastewater treatment plant operates 24 hours a day with a flow rate of 625 GPM. How many milliliters per minute of liquid alum will be needed in the waste stream to produce these jar test results? Well, on this particular problem, I'm going to insert uh, gallons per day, which has been calculated and published on a previous video. And I'm going to refer to that video now so you can um, you know, use it if you need it um, as a supporting explanation for, for this particular uh, solving this problem. Um, but you can go to this URL that's on the bottom of the screen here. And that will calculate the gallons of alum per day, which is 8.35. And once you go to that video, you'll also see the uh, supporting video that calculates the pounds of alum per day. Um, so if you need uh, information for any of those, uh, you know, feel free to refer to them. Um, but I'm going to take the 8.35 and I'm going to insert it in, in this uh, formula. Uh, for today's uh, uh, solution uh, for today's problem. And to answer milliliters per minute of alum per day, and starting with gallons per day, we're going to apply three separate conversion factors uh, to this uh, 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 as, as our solution. Um, we're going to take gallons per day and divide it by the number of minutes in the day that will actually give us, um, if it was a standalone uh, entry, it would give us gallons uh, per minute. And once we have gallons per minute, we can simply multiply it by the conversion factor from gallons to liters, which is um, going to give us liters uh, per minute. And, and then if we take liters per minute and multiply it by the conversion factor from liters to milliliters, that will give us milliliters per minute. So the three conversion factors is 1,440 minutes in a day, 3.785 liters in a gallon, and 1,000 milliliters in a liter. So uh, let's look and see how we can put all this in an Excel spreadsheet. Uh, you can go to an open uh, spreadsheet. Uh, you can uh, put your cursor in C1 and type in this description, milliliters per minute of alum. You can go to A1. And you can actually uh, format it as a number with one decimal. You make it bold and centered. And you can go into the formula bar and you can type in this formula. Equal sign, two open parentheses, 8.35. Close parentheses, division key, open parentheses, 1440. Two close parentheses, multiplication key, open parentheses, 3.785. Close parenthesis, multiplication key, open parenthesis, 1,000, close parenthesis, and then press enter and return key, and this is what you get, 21.9. So that's the answer, 21.9 milliliters per minute of liquid alum based on the uh, requirements of this problem. So I hope you found this to be useful and helpful. If so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I also urge you to participate and interact. Um, you can do so by going to my website, environmentalacademy.com. You can fill out the email form, 
or you can send me an email to the email address on the uh, website. But if so, come back often because I should be uh, publishing uh, new videos at least once weekly. So thanks for interacting. I appreciate you listening to this uh, five and a half minute video and see you soon.